Good evening. We begin with one of the final debates featuring the two front runners vying to be Ottawa's next mayor. The face off mostly respectful, but there were some surprises. All right, you read the title. Let's just talk about it, huh? Yesterday, I organized my team to deliver three blows against the so-called frontrunners at the Ottawa mayoral debate. Now, despite 80 to 90 percent of the people I talked to saying they're going to vote for me, I was not invited, presumably because they were afraid of my big girthy wall. We started off by organizing my top cult members in a park near the event. We're doing a three punch plan. Uh, first punch is 30 minutes in. I get up. I yell, 30 minutes and no talk of a wall? And, I, and I'm like, I'm getting up there. And I run, and then I, I get grabbed. Ah, whoa! <laughs> and then I'm gone. I'm, I'm like, the, the, th the threat is removed, okay? <laughs> the rest of my group were sleeper cells that were waiting for the one hour mark. Punch two, everyone remaining is going to yell, it's been one hour and still no talk of a wall? It's been an hour and still no talk of a wall? Everyone should leave. Everyone should remove yourself. Like out of protest. It's out of boredom. Municipal politics is extremely yeah. boring. Nothing like this ever happens. So now it's more exciting. Okay, remember, we walk a fine line between uh, based and cringe. And uh, and cringe. <laughs> comedy and crime. We walk a lot of fine lines, okay? So we don't want to do anything that would get us in legitimate trouble. Well, we do, but we can't. And this is how those punches went. I, th I think it's, they're gonna feel it. Definitely, yeah. That's what's important. We, we want them to feel it. We want them to feel things. We want to get through to the the Ottawa folk. We entered the venue in staggered lines so as not to draw too much attention to ourselves. I found out about you because uh, I have a local government class uh -huh. and I was pretty bored with the candidates. We quickly realized we were the youngest people there, everyone's 60, no one cares about municipal politics, so I stuck to my cover as an undecided voter. Uh, you might be right that you're not decided yet. Yeah, um, you know, I'm not, I'm not, I, I, I don't, I don't, I don't feel super good about either of the candidates right now. But, um, we'll but see. you're gonna vote, right? Yeah, I'm, I'm gonna vote, definitely. I'm gonna vote. And the front runners just keep complimenting each other because, oh, you're a politician and I like you. You're a politician and I like you. You know, like there's no actual substantive disagreement. Breaking news, breaking news. We have a deal when this is over. I'm buying Catherine a beaver tail because she's never had one before. Then I realized there was a special constable right behind me. So we had to switch our position to the other side of the venue where there was a clear line out the door once we made our seat. So 30 minutes went by and I'll be real with you, uh, I was freaking out. I had to step out for air at one point. Well, <clears throat> there's a lot of security and I'm terrified. Then uh, the 30 minute mark hit and I was, you can see on my face visibly I'm freaking out. So I just started growling to myself to build up the resolve to do what I needed to do. And then this oh, happened. I can't take it! It's been 30 minutes and no one's mentioned a wall! Where's the wall? The idea was that the handler had this thing of gum and he was gonna pour the gum down my mouth as though he was feeding me a bunch of pills. And the uh, handler pulled it off quite wonderfully. You can see the uh, chief constable going after me here. Uh, but it was it didn't go fast enough because we ran down the street right after. I really have like this image burned in my mind of Mark Sutcliffe and Catherine McKenney looking terrified. <laughs> <laughs> I saw genuine fear in their eyes. <laughs> Sutcliffe looked so mad. About that, but I know my time is up. He's just mad I called him Skeletor. Also, his face has kind of got a Skeletor thing going on. God, I fucking love being a nuisance. Okay. 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 Is that one of our volunteers? Are they okay? No. The answer to that question is no. So that's a stunt? Wait, 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 wait. Hold on. Okay. Was it a stunt or am I mentally ill? Yep. Everybody all right? Everybody all right? Oh, oh, the status quo was disrupted for 30 seconds. Is, is everyone okay? Okay. Yep. <laughs> so, sorry about that. We can't control everything. It's a public place. Yeah. Um, so 10 minutes after we did this, uh, I got a DM from this guy who was there. Very serious politics, man. Seek help. Okay, so my handler and I freaked out a little bit. Let's go for a little jog here, me. How about that? That sounds like a great idea. So, like, how's chat? How do you feel? Um, oh my god. I think that's probably the most exhilarating thing I've ever done in my fucking life. And then we waited for punch two. The one hour mark came and nothing happened. 
It seems like my team was getting spooked, but I messaged the group, do it, brick emoji, and one of the leaders of the group stood up and led the rest in executing punch number two. That much longer for a new police chief. They want leadership of their Been police chief. They never see the second one coming. So, anyone else? Tommy, I was going to say, how many? Go ahead right now. Get it out. Have? Get it out. So Get I it out and then say, we can move on. So everyone laughs uh, when he says I I anyone else. Um, <laughs> but you can tell he's actually extremely mad. The second time they actually had to justify themselves <laughs> for not inviting me. <laughs> oh, yes. I, hey, I, just, I do want to say this is an important point yeah. uh, because there's uh, 14 uh, people on the ballot. That's one of them. And we, we struggled uh, for our debate. Yeah. So it's easy to sit there and yell and obviously they want to be up here and they're pulling their stunts. That's fine. And so I, I'm speaking for this group, but I think they had the similar discussions about how to do this. So where were we? <laughs> <laughs> the second punch wasn't quite as strong okay, as it could We almost chickened out, but we did it. I was trying to get to the camera, like, give her from here! Yeah, the, uh, the people at the front didn't cause a scene. They just were like, and they opened the door for me. Yes, they, <laughs> they just they opened the door nicely yeah, for us. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I made I made sure to be like thank you very much to them when they opened the door and just top down all the steps and left. <laughs> so leading up to it, how did it feel? Stressful. Stressful. Stressful yes. Amazing. Yeah, it was uh, nervous. Uh, took us a few seconds to stand up. How do you feel? How did you feel? Uh, I was really nervous. <laughs> and how do you guys feel after? Good, good. Yeah, I'm glad I did that. How was the anxiety? Near max. Yeah, nearly max. Nearly, nearly max really on the anxiety. anxiety. And how did you feel after? Definitely catharsis. Yeah, because it's <laughs> it's a little bit over, and I can just yell. How are you feeling? Oh, I, I, honestly, I'm feeling pretty great. That was that was awesome. I was sitting there, I was like, oh man, I'm so nervous. I don't. Are, are we gonna get caught by them? I'm gonna wait a second before I stand up. I want to be the second to stand up, and no one's there. I was like, oh no, no one's standing up. The second's gonna flop. And then Cat took charge, and we all went on. Yeah. We all went in on it. It was super great. Yeah, you feel alive, don't you? Oh, I feel so alive. I, yeah. I understand your energy right now. Yeah. Especially after I went back and watched the recording of you leaving. Yeah. I, I could feel that energy. I was like, oh my, it was so great. Everything worth doing is over a big wall of anxiety. Yeah. Yeah. You know, you get over it, feels really good. Maybe that point is correct, but the 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 way I'm demonstrating it might not be. Apparently, yeah. like, so there was a live stream. Apparently, they were banning any mention of drag. And punch three. Well, punch three happened as well. The the theme here is that every every one of these punches, they think the threat has been dispelled, but then the final threat comes in. This is Mark Taylor previous deputy mayor of Ottawa and current vice president of United Way. And this is the question we asked him. Up from five five years ago, we did a similar poll. It wasn't us, but the same people in our politics club. And back then, they measured about 40% uh, approval rate, but now um, it's risen to 63% approval rating amongst students at college and university to secede Ottawa from Canada. Absolutely, there are things that divide us. But again, I'm going to come back to the theme of there's more that unites us. We just have to be able to see as a community and as a country, you know, the opportunity to draw wisdom from those things. New campaign promise. I will rename United Way, United Wall. The disruptions were reported on immediately, uh, but as is typical for the lying mainstream media press, uh, they said that it was diffused by the moderator. No, it wasn't. We diffused ourselves. Also, no mention of why the disruptions happened. Uh, it's because we were protesting the lack of big wall around Ottawa, Ontario. That's an essential aspect of the news. So overall, great success. I'd like to thank my cult for making this happen. I'd like to take a moment of silence for all the burned bridges in my municipal politics career now. Rest in piss. And I got this email thanking me for attending the event afterwards. All I can say is the pleasure was all mine. You know, those people, clearly no respect for the political process. Um, you know, no respect for democracy, uh, caused quite a scene, so I hear. And, uh, yeah, those people don't, uh, re represent our movement. They are, they're not true wall supporters. Uh, I disavow entirely, and, uh, a lot of people say I was there, I wasn't there. That could have been anybody. No, no, it could have been anybody. Uh, could have, could have been anybody there, so, yeah. Oh, hello, uh, did, uh, how's it going, Mom? Thank you for the alien. 
Uh, no, 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 I didn't go to jail. Definitely leave them alone for the rest of the debate. Yeah, I think, I think we can leave them alone now.